back to another video my name is stephanie and i am <laughs> okay let's do it again take two right uh hi welcome back to another video my name is stephanie in case you're just seeing me for the first time uh welcome thank you for clicking and hopefully you like this video and you end up subscribing liking commenting sharing you know all that good stuff the goal is to hit 10k this year right so that's the goal we're like on 6k7 but the goal is to hit 10k between now and december even though the chances are slim it's not looking like the prospects is not are not looking so good but i'm being hopeful that by december we're going to be doing 10k subscribers so yeah welcome back to another video like i said and this is the first time seeing me welcome as well if you're if you're an og on the channel welcome to um yeah so today is saturday and if you're nigerian if you're a nigerian or you've lived in nigeria before or you've been to nigeria you will know that saturdays are like chore days like we do chores on saturdays not that you can't do them every or any other day but it's just a tradition right we grew up seeing these things you have to wash your clothes on saturday you have to do like deep cleaning on saturday you have to wash the bathroom on saturday so saturday is like the day where you like do the heavy work so yeah i'm doing that today so uh the first thing is to see if you're hearing noise they are splitting firewood in my compound i think that we have an occasion or something but we're splitting firewood outside so yeah anyways um I'm, i would start by washing my clothes then cleaning my house then washing my bathroom well which is part of my house then later in the day i might go out i might go out i don't know because the individual that's supposed to carry us out or go that we are the individual we're going out with he's sick i don't know if he's going to be able to go it's like an organizational event there's an organization that he belongs to they're having an event and he invited me and another colleague of mine so we're going so we are all colleagues basically um but yeah let me do that and i'll be seeing you all later so let's go wash clothes i've been learning this that hey you know that that um twalabam or shalabam that mm, 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 mm. it's still hard i'm still working on it but yeah so i made spaghetti and egg for dinner i feel like in this economy the easiest thing you can make is spaghetti and egg and that is what i'm having for dinner today so bon appetit So in here, just my chicken, onions, maggie, salt, and that's all. I added a little bit of ginger and garlic, and it's not really a little bit of ginger and thyme. Even though the doctor said I. what's up so today is sunday it's a new month so welcome to june um i hope you all are doing well i haven't filmed since the last time you guys saw me and that's because i've been sick like i had a crazy i've had the crazy past week like my part the, the the previous week was really like so much for me and just been a roller coaster of you know emotions you know trying to get well trying to feed well trying to be better that Saturday, I started having diarrhea. Then on Sunday, it was malaria. Monday, I started having ulcer, like everything. I have taken ulcer medications before, however, but I don't know. When I went to get drugs for the malaria, the lady asked me, do you have ulcer? I said, no, because it's been like two years. So I guess that triggered it. So I've been treating ulcer and all stuff. So I feel better now. It's uh, 2nd of June. 
June or June, just that I'm just now that we entered 2024. Anyways, I want to go and buy shawarma because it's that time of the month and my body is in charge of me right now. Like, my body is telling me what to do. I'm like, I'm no longer in control of my body, but I was going to buy shawarma. Hopefully, I asked a doctor friend of mine if it's possible to eat shawarma because, like they say, they tell you to avoid acidic food if you have like peptic ulcer and stuff like that. So, I think he said yes. Did he? I don't know. I think he did. So I want to use sunscreen. That's finished though. Ain't no money to buy new one. Ain't no money. There's Sakba. So if you are watching my video, please subscribe and share. So I will see money to buy new sunscreen. I don't have money. Because everything is so expensive these days. And nobody really tells you all that if you're like planning to be an adult you just want to grow up so fast and you just want to look be independent and nobody tells you that when you grow up you spend money like you spend so much money i have to like brush my hair because never to be cut off fresh of course brush your hair brush your hair and no lip balm more. i told you guys i don't use lip balm i use vaseline because since my last experience, I have stayed away from lip balm. I love my lips. I feel like my lips are like the cutest part of my face. I don't know. I, I just feel that way because they're like naturally red and supple. So yeah. Anyways, deodorant. I'm using this one. It smells like it's called Dear Body. It is blackberry. This uh, this is like one of those nighttime perfumes or body spray rather. Like one of those nighttime body sprays that you use at night if you have a man just to smell edible. Did I come out wrong? <laughs> but yeah. This is one of them, and it smells so good. It smells like the first when I used it the first time, I was like, God, I want to eat myself. Like I smelled like I smelled like blackberry, and it smells really nice. Oh, that is enough. Then this one that I've been using since this other one. Was, so I'm just going to. I hope I don't smell conflict. But these are like two different. This one is feminine. This one is like masculine. I like masculine sprays, but this one is still good. So yeah, I had my nails done over the week. What's the world I say? I had my nails done on Friday. They look cute, yeah. And I have this cute ring here. I don't want to put it here. This is the only finger it enters completely. I don't want to put it here, so I don't chase these people away because i'm not married i'm not dating so why why, why would i do that <laughs> anyway let's go and buy shower bar because i've been carrying around lately this beaded paws atm card so if not for peer pressure if no if not for you i have not open op account i've never hey chineke no more i've never like thought of opening an op account or all those accounts that you have on your phone that are not like actual commercial banks but every time I go to UBA to get an ATM card, the queue is crazy long. The queue is crazy long. I don't know, I've not even attempted to go to Zenith Bank either, but I just figured I will get an open account because I don't want no stress. You know that whiskey song? I don't want no stress. Is that how it sang? I did not how they sang that song. But you know that no stress by whiskey, that's the level I'm operating on. So ATM cards and I'm not spending more than 14 minutes outside my house. social media publication alleging the entry of suspected bandits into the federal capital territory. The statement emphasized the importance of public cooperation 
and the command's commitment to maintaining security in the area. So I spent most of yesterday night making chin chin. This is it. So this is a customer order that I'll be sending out very soon. And this is two liters. Yeah, this is a two liter container of chin chin.